Hello everyone, welcome back to Form of Therapy. My name is PD, and today Itzy's back. Itzy is back, and more importantly, Leah's back. I am so excited. I'm excited because one, Leah is back. Uh, Leah, after taking her hiatus from the previous uh, round of promotions, is back. I'm so happy for her. I'm so glad she is one of my favorite members in Etsy, and uh, I'm just I'm I'm so happy. Uh, and I have a lot of high expectations for Gold because second, oh, they're born to be album. Their Born to Be album, I think, is the best Itzy comeback ever because, first off, Leah's solo song is amazing. Blossom is amazing, uh, as well as um, Chet Young's Mine. <laughs> Love Chet Young's Mine. Uh, Crown on My Head is also epic. But listen, Dynamite and Mr. Vampire are just some of the best Itzy songs. I think, it's, I think Mr. Vampire is my favorite Itzy song, period. So... The enthusiasm was real uh, for me after the previous Itzy comeback. So the hype going into gold is real. Um, I even just immediately added the album to my library. It looks like like what final versions of like uh, their solo songs as well as like uh, some of the other Born to Be songs. Like final version of Mr. Vampire. What does that mean? I don't know. I'm excited to find out. Uh, but with that in mind, let's check out gold. Or like gold prospecting. Go into my head, going all out of control, cause I shine so bright like dynamite gold. Yeah. Whoa. What is this production? Whoa. Oh. She said, only had a wait a minute. Moon's an option. Wait a minute. Jonga Jamie Ninga Chaz, I got one easy. Just keep it going up. Could the note of a young girl till the name That thing that you do, that thing that you do. Put on the shine, mommy. Whoop. Yeah. Diamond in my heart, but I'm horny. Do what's the deal? Always in my head, you are a kid on my favorite song. Now I'm muddy as head on the dead. I feel like it is constantly rotating. It's constantly rotating its sound. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Whoa. I love this part so much. Whoa, that shift is so jarring. Whoa. Whoa, they're head banging. Oh my god. What? What the heck is this? God, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. 
Oh my god, they murdered that. Oh my goodness. Oh, I love gold so much. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. Wow. That, that is, I think, one of the most undeniably perfect Itzy title tracks. Uh, I think it is one of my favorite Itzy music videos. We'll get into the music video aspect on a second watch through, but to kind of summary it, it is because I think this music video so perfectly encapsulates the epic scale of, I think, Itzy's power. I think Itzy, up until the Born to Be comeback, everything else up until that point, it, they've been doing like concepts here and there, and the music videos have always felt very concept-driven, right? Whether it's the Mafia in the Morning music video or Sneakers, uh, it always felt like... It just... It never felt like the... the it hasn't felt for a while that the concept of Itzy's music videos were Itzy in and of itself. That's not a bad thing, okay? Love conceptual-driven music videos, okay? But gold, and especially with just Itzy's years in the industry, and I would say their veteran status at this point, and how incredible and talented they are, I have been waiting for the glow-up. I have been waiting for the queen treatment. And I felt like I felt like Born to Be, especially after hearing the album, I was like, this is it. It's he, it's his reign and their era of we we're hot shit era is beginning. And yeah, I was right. Gold really capitalizes on that and it is a braggadocious song with braggadocious lyrics talking about how brightly they shine like gold how shimmering they are and i think it is one of those songs where one the music video uh really enhances the song so i i can't tell you I can't tell you fully how I feel about this song until I do a listening party because the music video just is so grand and it is so epic that it makes me love. I like, I know I love this song, but I'm like, I can't tell just on a purely objective level of like what I like about this song and like stuff like that. Um, I more so, especially I think as a video producer, love it because I think the song really serves it feels like the song is serving the video which i know is not the case they made the song first and then the music video but that's just how good the music video is it feels like the song is like a soundtrack to this epic music video um wow uh let's uh let's watch it again oh At that point, I thought I'm going to wind back a little just to see these transitional snaps. <sighs> really? Okay. Um, at that point, I thought we were going to get like uh, maybe a pop rock driven song. But I love that. I think I also love how just a mishmash it feels like. Wow. That's a wow. Oh, wow. That's multiple shots connected together. Wow, that's cool. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. I see. So we're rewinding before they blow shit up. Yeah. Interesting that the they've got the infinite mirror effect going on, but the timing is different. That's interesting. Ooh. 
God, the the incoming. It's a, it's a damn joints beat. Wow, on an itzy title track. That's that's cool. <laughs> Ooh, oh my God! Ah, love that little the 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 cutouts. The bop bop bop. What I love is that this music video so undeniably has personality. It's not just like oh the scale is big. There's a lot of money in it. It's those little things like like having those shots like having an edit like that having shots like that really gives just an added personality and depth to it that is that extra level of treatment i've been looking forward to in their videos I love it. I love this. I love this chanting. Oh my god. Oh. Whoa. Okay. One more time. Their dance party is literally causing a cataclysmic event and splitting this house apart. God damn. This. This pre-chorus beat is insane. Wow. Oh. I love how they shot Yeji's portions right here. Oh, it's so fucking cool. Oh my god. The speed ramping into the slow down effects. Oh my god. Wow, wait a minute. Oh my god. I didn't even notice the Wow. So, yeah, so I, this is even just like straight up practical lighting work. This isn't, I don't think this is even an edit. Wow, it's not, baby. That is, oh shit, that's insane. That is one of the coolest transitional moments ever. So we're already on this set that we're about to cut into, but what we're doing with the edge of here is like cutting to these low and high angles, but we've drastically changed the lighting so that we kill all the background uh, imagery, so we can't see that um, at 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 the top. But then you know, once we got to this shot, all they do is just bring all the lights back on and then turn. I, I don't think they even turn it off. They just bring all the lights back on and then reveal back to this huge gold set. Oh my god, that's incredible. Oh, that's so cool. Oh god. The blocking. <sighs> the blocking cannot be understated. Uh, Leah walking out of set. Although I'm pretty sure... I'm pretty sure they're keyed out. It doesn't... It doesn't look like Eugen is in the same shot. This looks this looks like it's keyed out. It looks like it's a separate play. I could be wrong, but the way she comes in and then whips out as we're pulling out and it's exploding on beat to bum 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 is incredible. Wow. Again, Going through this hallway, just what a weird mystical transition. Oh, the absolute like, like it's called gold. And I like the word that pops into my head a lot with this music video is it's grand. And I think this lighting, uh, again, some of the grandest moments are just practical effects. There's, there's a lot of CG in this video, but it's the practical stuff that really give me this moving mode like it moves my heart and just the way the lights turn on on beat it, it makes it look like such a grand spectacle oh. Gold everywhere, 
지금조차 없는 shadow 너라는 존재로 Hey 나는 이제 Oh, these are the outfits they're in at the end. What you wanna do, what you wanna do, took me a man again. Yeah. Diamond in my heart, got a dinner soon, what's the deal? Always in my head, you are repeating wow, my face. What a, wow, what a transition. Yes, oh, that's so awesome. The two separate shots and the way they bring that in is so awesome. Again, rather than cutting to the it's like gold and big reveal shot, they they go for the practical, they go for the practical zoom out. It really gives it like a big um almost like a musical effect, like you're watching a, a big grand musical movie like yeah, Les Mis cool. or something, the way that this comes in. It's like <sighs> They're headbanging. I love it. Damn, Leah's vocals there too. The hits like go. Oh. Wow. Oh, again, again, the practical lighting during Eugene's part right here. They're just, they're just switching between uh, different lighting sources rather than cutting. And that looks so goddamn cool. Now that's a cut. Now, what is going on here? Ooh, ooh. Oh, that's interesting. So they key out just Eugen and then everything kind of like almost like gold like liquid gold kind of melts they just do like this sort of melting effect real quick and then cut right back oh this last set man it's like, it's like, it's like, it's like again back to some of the really fun edits the timing it's like, edits it's like, it's like, it's oh the on the it's like it's like it's like oh my god I love that so much. Oh, it gives it, especially for this uh, moment in this final bridge, it, it gives it so much swagger, so much power. I love this shot at the end too when they're dancing right here. It looks like they're giants towering in a mound of gold. And this shot is just mainly achieved by the fact that it's that's a second floor that they're on. And we saw them dancing on top of this set multiple times throughout the music video. But the camera is on the first floor and it's a wider lens. And so it's more of a warped perspective. And so the closer you get, it creates it's it's creating this perspective image shift where they look bigger. They look almost like Titans. Incredible. Oh, interesting. Is that supposed to look like gold within like the earth as well, like mixed with lava? It's beginning. Oh, oh my God. Let the, let the itsy rain begin. Oh my goodness. I have been waiting for this moment for so long. Oh my God. Itsy, itsy. Oh my God. They, I feel like, listen, stuff like Cheshire, stuff like sneakers, stuff like, uh, all of these conceptual stuff is good. Don't get me wrong, okay? But uh, it, it's with any K-pop group. You know you've made it, and you and I think it's especially one of the most fun 
like one of the most fun runs when a group's concept becomes themselves. And I think that it really requires years of building up your own skills and your own solid foundation as well as your fan base, but also like having this confidence as well as accolades and achievements to really be able to actually say this, to actually mean and own up to like how big and powerful this feels is like yeah it's he is like gold uh you know like they have been in the industry for so long and i mean they've been eating it for so long i mean i i still i still remember when they debut with tala tala and you know subsequently coming out with you know, hits like Not Shy. And then, of course, Wannabe was a whole viral hit. But I have, I think maybe for about a year or two, been really hoping for a concept like this. Untouchable is cool. But I think what I also like is like, the sound was, with Untouchable, a little too itsy. Like, it's, it's, it's a very itsy sound. Gold sounds like itsy, but it feels like it's also very experimental. And I think when you're in a position like this, when you're able to do a concept of your own, it feels like you're breaking new ground, which I think kind of like suits really well with the whole gold and prospecting for gold concept. You have to really push your boundaries. Like you have to maintain uh, a familiarness to your sound, but you also have to be doing something new. And this beat is wild. It is insane. And I, I'm really excited. I'm really excited for this album. Really excited to hear uh, what the new songs are. Uh, I love it. I love the title track. I love the music video thus far. Uh, again, I'm going to have to really wait till the album and be not distracted by such a phenomenal music video to really know uh how much i actually love this song and how i feel about this song but uh this was this was a fun one guys uh thank you for tuning into my reaction to itsy's gold if you enjoyed this and uh you want to see my re listening party reaction i am going to check it out next month uh over on our patreon so uh you can check that out link is going to be in the description down below uh, you can also just simply subscribe uh, and support us for free, uh, as well as checking out our other reactions over here. Uh, hopefully, when I did add this gold album to my um, to my uh, library, uh, I also saw that there were like other other tracks, like two other tracks, were earmarked as I think singles. So we might be getting music videos for a couple other songs off this as well. So uh, yeah, be sure to subscribe to tune in when I react to those. Uh, thanks for tuning in. I'll see you later. Bye.